You there! Come here! Over here! We can help each other. What is your name? I don't even know who I am. Or where I am. Or how I got here. You died. It happens. Welcome to the domain of the lost. I am, of course, King Palawa Joko. King Joko? I... I'm sorry, I don't know that name. Liar! All who take breath know me. I am King Joko the Inevitable. The last primeval king. Joko the Undying. The Scourge of Fabi. Joko the Feared. Joko the Beloved. Joko, the eternal monarch of all. How dare you claim to not know who I am? But you're not a spirit. What are you doing here? I was deceived by the fallen god Balthazar. I led him here to claim spirits for his army. In exchange, I was promised a share of his new recruits. But he betrayed me, and stranded me here instead. Perfidy! From now on, the only god I trust is me. You are no god. You are an abomination inflicted on the crystal desert like a wound. Like a plague. I am a god. God King of Alona. The Crystal Desert and all their environs. Genuflect, peasant. You have no authority here. Only the judge does. He was appointed by Grenn, a true god. Ah, gods, dragons, nations. Soon all will grovel at the feet of Paloa Joto. Come, gentle spirit. You must take the next steps, and I've heard enough of Joko's blasphemies. The domain of the law is the judge. Stay close. He is a loyal servant of Grim, charged with sending all the spirits who come through here to their appointed place. But I don't know who I am. I don't know where I should be. Come, spirit. Do not be afraid. I'm not sure why I'm here. Or even who I am. That's because most spirits find their own way to their fate when they die. But those whose deaths are too traumatic often forget who they were or how they perished. These spirits, like you and me, end up here, in the Domain of the Lost. I can't be here. You will reach your rightful place in time. First, you must recover your name, to know who you were and how you lived. Then, you must learn your purpose, to understand the choices you made, and why you lived as you did. Once you know your name and purpose, only then can I determine your final destination. But how do I do that? Nana has traveled the path you now face. She can assist you. For though they may have belonged to you in life, once your name and purpose enter this domain, they are yours no longer, and you will have to fight to reclaim your name. Now, arm yourself. Elena, so you discovered your name. How do I reclaim mine? I learned my name from the spirit of my old mentor, but only after vesting him in a challenge of riddles. I discovered my purpose hidden in an old diary I had written as a child. I was a teacher. Is it that simple? It's different for everyone. The judge said you must fight to recover your name. 
So you clearly were the teacher. A soldier, perhaps? I... I don't know. Well, if you are to fight, you must first arm yourself. With what? Spirits must abandon their positions before they may move on. Nothing here. I'll have to keep searching. Nothing here. I'll have to keep searching. Nothing here. I'll have to keep searching.
was a leader, a commander. I could tell. You wielded that weapon like a true fighter. But I don't know why I fought, what I strove for, or against. Next is your purpose. Who drove you forward and ultimately led to your death? The answer is here, somewhere in the domain of the lost. You just have to find it. But how will I know it? Where will I find it? If you truly desire it, your purpose will find you. Start with the bird. Birds are prey. Go on, Hunter. Show us what you can do. My, My time, time as a hero has come and gone. You're the hero that Holbrecht needs now. When, when Zaitan rose from slumber, the dragon found a long-dead nation and claimed it. The soul of Tyria mourned as her children were cut down by the beast. The land wept and the world shuddered. Nobody believed I had courage. Not even me. Then you came along. But you trusted me then, my friend. I need you to trust me now. I can do this. Our victory at Fort Trinity will show the world that we can strike against the dragons. We can assault Ara. We can destroy Zaitan before the dragon's inflection claims us all. We have succeeded, but only by coming together to fight a greater foe. You have shown the way. You've had my gratitude, Commander, for all you've done. Tonight, 
I saw it. I stared into the abyss, and it stared back at me. So much power. I don't know what's real and what isn't anymore. The city. It's, it's gone. gone. All, all gone. Aren't you even curious about why I did it? All this chaos and destruction? Listen! Her shield drops when she attacks. Make it count! End this! Now! Something I can no longer protect. You must <coughs> understand its importance to Tyria's future. The, the legends. You're, you're not leaving until you tell me the truth. We, we come from the jungle, dragon. We, we belong to it. We are, we are meant to serve it. Now with everything we had to deal with here, the Pax fleet may have already launched. We're over a welcome sight, Commander. The situation is grim. Mordermoth tore the fleet apart. The Pact is in ruins. I don't, I don't trust him, Barry. You need me to should you. Spring has chosen you. Channel this gift to get the egg to safety. Go. Confront Maldromoth. No matter how that mission ends, know that you have restored hope to Tarir and to the world. You must kill me, Commander, before that seed grows. Before Mordromoth reclaims what it has lost. Our creator now lies vanquished. Where does that leave the Solari? What is our place in this new world we've created? Join Destiny's Edge. My mother wouldn't want you in there. And I laid down my life for. Uh, what should we call it? Her. Her, her. her name is Aureen. Last Marsat. Many years ago, you knew me as Lazarus the Dyer. I have returned from the brink of existence. But, but who would pose as Lazarus? No, it can't be. Thank <laughs> you. 
the dragons who will die. And fire will unchain all. I... I remember. Balthazar. He wants revenge on the other gods. And he's going to use Ori to get it. I have to convince the judge to send me back. Strength welcomes all, noble spirit. Step forward, and I will send you to your appointed place. You must let me go back. I see you clearly now, Commander. Balthazar killed you, but you would face him again? Balthazar has done great harm here. The magic he uses to hijack spirits shakes the foundations of the domain of the lost. But I cannot help you. If I could only get back. If I could defeat him, it might undo the damage he's done in both our worlds. <sighs> it is too late. No life remains in your body. Unless... when Balthazar left, a fearsome beast, the Eater of Souls, rose to prey on the waning life energy of the spirits here. That's got to be the scream I've heard in the distance. If you were to defeat the beast and claim its power, that life energy might be strong enough to reanimate your body, allowing you to go back. But... If you were to fail, the beast would consume your entirety. I could grant you no final reward or punishment. Your spirit would simply cease to be. I'll take that risk. Now that I've rediscovered my purpose, I have to go back to finish where I started. Then in Grant's name, Conquer the Eater of Souls and live again. Remind Balthazar that none escape judgment.
Ugh. <laughs> 